is how I create this time scroll effect in CapCut. Start by recording yourself scrolling on your phone or your iPad. After that, open CapCut, click on New Project, click on Library, and we are going to select an empty background. So I'll click on this black and I will add it to my project. Now click on your project, scroll to the right, click on Split and delete the unwanted part. The next thing we want to do is to add text. So click on Text. And you are going to type in the numbers you want to scroll it doesn't have to be numbers you can also type text if you want but in this case i'll be typing i'll be using numbers after that click on font and change it to the font you like the next thing you want to do is to expand the text to make it bold so it's readable just the way i'm doing it once you drag it it's going to expand the next thing you want to do is to change the font color so click on style and you're going to pick any color of your choice one thing about this part is that make sure you don't pick any color that is related to your background color. If not, your text is not going to show. So pick a color that is totally different from your background. The next thing you want to do is to drag the text to make sure that it's only the first um, word that is showing just like this. Once you are done adjusting it, click on the text and add a keyframe. Scroll to the end of the text again, add another keyframe. After adding it, just drag the text to the top. After that, click on this icon scroll to the right and click on ease this will smoothen the keyframe we added after that export your video now open CapCut again open new project and you're going to add in the video of you scrolling add it as a new project click on overlay and we are going to be adding the video of the numbers we just created i have to i have this one and i have this red one so i'll be going with the red one after adding it while your overlay video is still selected scroll to the right and you are going to click on max click on rectangle now click on this icon to adjust the width of your video drag it like that to expand it now adjust the frame to fit into the number or the text nicely like that and you are going to click on this icon to feather in the video so it's not looking sharp i mean so the edges are not looking sharp after that click on done and you are going to scroll back to the left click on splice click on filter and the filter is going to remove the background of your text and all you need to do is to click on your text and you adjust it nicely to and position it where you want it to be after that it should have something like this but it depends on the speed of your scrolling if the speed is too much click on the number project and you're going to click on speed and you're going to now adjust the speed if it's too much you reduce it if it's too slow you increase the speed to make it more engaging we want to add a sound effect to it while none of your clip is selected click on audio and you're going to click on sound now type this in the search bar scroll and search for the scroll sound effect after that play each sound to see which one resonates with the kind of content you want to use the video for once you found anyone you like just click on the plus icon and it's going to be added to your project now adjust it to where when you started scrolling to sync both your action and the sound effect now cut away the ss part and if you follow these steps correctly you should have something like this at the end of the day